good morning out there, all you incredible viewers to play later. How are we doing today? Today is the start of a project. It really, truly is. It's an unboxing, and it's a start of a pretty fucking expensive unit I'm going to be bringing to the table. But still, as you know by that thumbnail, everything that's clicked on to get here today, that's right. We're looking at the Warhammer 40k Space Marines Jump Pack Intercessors. Or as they're going to be known in my force, my Sky Claws. That's right, my Blood Claws with Jump Packs. <clears throat> I can have up to 15, I believe, in my unit. Plus, oh my god, with the 3D bits that I've ordered, because I don't have a 3D printer, this is going to get expensive. But still, we're going to get the adulting out of the way here in just one second, but you know how we do it. First up, is a word from our unofficial sponsor. What up, you amazing people? Hope you're doing well today. Chris has asked me to do a quick elevator spill just for you. Now, here at Copper John's, I'm always preaching, be proud of who you are, no matter what. What this means to me is simply that you're gonna go out there to the world and present yourself in a way that you are proud of. So my job is to create something that allows you to do that. So here at Copper John's, I have 13 different scents, all in beard oil, beard butter, beard balm, mustache wax, spray clone, and a few of the solid clones. But we also have some amazing cold press soaps, beard shampoos, whether conditioning or stripping, beard conditioner, and some crazy cool combs. I am truly grateful for every one of you guys. If you ever need anything, please don't hesitate to hit me up. I'm here. Have a great day, guys. Take care. Incredible man, incredible company. Seriously, click that link down below in the description box if you're into self-care. He's got you hooked up all over the place. Now, I am filming this video on Thursday, February 1st, 2024. I bought this at my... Where'd you go? <laughs> my finger's covering it. At my local gaming store, Docking Bay 93. If you are in Sketch Valley, Washington, you need to check them out. Incredible little mom and pop gaming store. They will treat you right in there. I paid 60 bucks for this. You get five in there. So if you just extrapolate that out, that's going to be about a $200 unit just to put them on the tabletop. I have been just going over my head and over my head and over my head about that fast attack you know, space wolf force that I've been telling you guys about. Things between packs of Outriders, you know, blood claws on bikes, hooting and hollering, running around like, you know, the doing raids. I've been trying to figure out how to get my Marines into combat quicker without, oh, well, you put them in a Rhino and they just rocketed the crap out of that Rhino and you lost half your force before you even got halfway across the tabletop. So this is something I'm looking at. All right, so we're going to do kind of an unboxing because, well, you just saw me take the tape, you know, the, the cellulite off of cellulite, the, the wrapper. I'm having a morning, all right? Okay, well, you're in there. Now... For those of you really not familiar with Games Workshop products, well, number one, welcome to my channel. Oh, yeah, I forgot. There you go, guys. There's the back of the box for those of you who like to see it. I like the fact up top they give you colorations of different marine, well, forces. That way you can get an idea in your head where you want to go. Everything, and I do mean everything they sell, comes on sprues. If you've ever put together model car, model plane, model tank, model ship, model whatever... <clears throat> you're used to sprues or bags full of product that you have to lay out and, you know, get to going. Every single one of those things has a little number associated with it. So, it's pretty much straightforward what you need to do to get it done. Yes, I am with you guys. Every single one of these little bastards seems to have a tactical rock. Ah, oh, sweet baby Jesus. I'm not fans of Tactical Rocks, so I'm going to try to come up with something different. I don't know, maybe some 3D printed flying stuff. I, I just, I don't know. I've been waiting a while for my first 3D print order from Only Games, I believe it is. They say it can take up to, you know, 10 business days. So, yeah, I'm on the ninth business day. But, okay, so, there's your sprues. Now, you also get your bases. <sighs> you bastards. I think this is the stuff they're going to for their standard transfer sheets. Ultramarines, Imperial Fists, Salamanders, and Raptors. I'm a Space Wolf player. Can I get a little support? Just saying. Been a Space Wolf player since 2nd edition. <sighs> but there you go. 
big old transfer sheet. That's probably going to go in a giveaway that I'm doing soon. I've been racking up a lot of those. need to make them go away. And you get your little instruction book, how to put them together. On the back is, well, basically your data card. Okay, now, when you're putting these together, like I said, you've got different ways to do it. As you see right there for that sergeant, there's one in blue, there's one in green. Follow your color coding, all right? Anywhere you see yellow on that instruction sheet is where they are suggesting that's where you're going to glue. So, follow it through. Design these guys how you want to via your codex, okay? All right, so basically it's pretty much straightforward going through. I like the fact they give you a crap ton of bits and bobs and all that other neat stuff so you can really kit them out if you want to. Like I said, I ordered some 3D parts. I really want to make my blood claws really over-the-top wolfy. I thought I was going to do it with my Reavers, but no. My, 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 my sky claws. I, I just, ugh. I'm getting this in my head about, like, two units of Outriders, that's three bikes, and, like, the little ATV, running into battle with, like, hordes of sky claws jumping down on top of you. I know they're blood claws, and all they basically have is, like, a bolt pistol and a chainsaw and maybe a power fist, but it's still getting in early, getting in quick, closing that gap quickly with maybe some long fang support in the back. I, I, I'm just I'm trying to work it all out in my head. I know there's somebody out there going, Durr, this is how you're going to do it. Durr. Drop a comment down below. Seriously, if you have ever made a fast attack Space Wolf Force, drop a comment down below. What you did, your unit thing, everything like that. But still, I get a little bit ahead of myself because we're at the most important part of the video. I want to know your, this is where your comment comes into play, questions, comments, love, hatred, anger, all that fun stuff down below. How do you feel about these Assault Intercessors? Are you kind of getting pissed at tactical rocks on everything that Games Workshop does? I mean, ugh, I, I'm trying not to be that guy, but I'm becoming that guy. I don't know, maybe I'll do some raised cork, because I've been playing around with that, like raised cork bases for rocky outcropping that they're kind of either bounding over or something like that. Maybe depending on how only games go, seeing if I can find, you know, uh, jump pack exhaust, because I really, truly wanted to order from Deadly Prince, but because they're in Europe, my bank won't let me. So I'm thinking about getting, like, a gift card and seeing if I can go that way to get a solid 3D print, because, like I said, don't have a 3D printer. I don't even know anyone locally who has a 3D printer that I can go, hey, I'll buy the STL. I'll even help pay for the damn, you know, resin. Just, I need your time and your patience. But still. Okay. Now, if I made you laugh, made you cringe, made you cry, made you do any of that, I'm pretty sure that it did. Hit that big old thumbs up. It's only going to show love and support for the channel. And that is always appreciated. But there we go, guys. My quick, weird unboxing of the start of a passion project of Skyclaws. The Space Marine Jump Pack Intercessors. Oh, these are going to be fun. I just... I don't know. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun to get them together. It's going to be expensive. But thanks God, ta tax time throwing around, right? That's going to help take a massive sting out of that bite of putting those guys on the field. <sighs> okay. I want to thank you guys once again for watching this one. Hope you're having a great day today. A safe day today. And the Emperor willing, one day, I'll see you across the tabletop.